All right, so crabbing can be a lot of fun, but you got to put in the work in order to have that fun. Today, I'm going to show you everything that I do when I go out to go crabbing from beginning all the way to the time I get home. So first, it starts with me loading everything up at 3.30 in the morning. You know, my baskets, I have to load them up. Then, of course, I have my big basket as well that has all of the stuff inside that I need to do to cook. I got to load up the chair so I have something to sit down on. Can't forget the grill. We got to throw that in the back. And then, of course, the container to put the crabs in as well. Lastly, we have to go ahead and load our poles in. Now, question. How many of y'all ever forgot your poles and had to go back home and get your poles after you got to where you were supposed to go grab it? Next, I'm going to go ahead and collapse my cart so I can fold it up and throw it in the car. I love this dolly. The main reason is because it's so compact. And then, of course, I can't forget the snares. You got to remember the snares. Now, I have to pack up all the equipment I'm going to need today in order to shoot my video. That includes my charging wires, my portable solar charger, my speaker, my light, and my GoPro. And you definitely cannot forget your bait. In here I have my squid, my pike, as well as some chicken. Then I have to load up everything I'm gonna cook today, including my lunch. And then of course, you know, we can't forget about the drinks either. I have some sodas. I'm gonna go ahead and put in some water so we, you know, we stay hydrated throughout the day. All right, so we had a little bit of a delay. I was trying to leave at 3.30, but unfortunately my video that I'm trying to upload didn't work out the way I was supposed to. I had to do a little bit of re-editing, re-upload. So it took a while. So now it's roughly about 6.30 that we're heading out, but it's all right, you know, we'll get there. We're gonna do that catch and cook today, baby, yeah. So stay tuned, enjoy the video. Happy holidays, y'all. Then we still have to get to our location. So let's go ahead and fast forward and listen to some good beats until we get there.
All right, so we finally made it. It's roughly about 7.15. All right, so the first thing I noticed as soon as I step out the car, man, it's windy. It is windy. Damn, Tony, you sure do have a lot of stuff with you. They don't realize, like, that bottom is empty. I mean, that's just for me to put my pole holder so it doesn't bend over, you know, and all that weight push down. A lot of it is just empty space. So if you didn't realize today's video, you know, grabbing is supposed to be fun. And it is, but not without hard work. You gotta put in hard work to have fun. Today, as you notice, I'm gonna showcase what I do from beginning all the way to the end of my day when I go crabbing, so y'all see how my life is out here. So I have a video coming out in the next couple weeks where I showcase my all my gear for the jetty and for the beach and for the pier, which are completely, completely different. So I'm gonna showcase that as well. So keep an eye out for that video. Use it more like a, uh, like a, cause there is one, not one of them are gonna catch a crab. Yeah, that sucks, man. I, you know. All right, we packed up. Let's get out there. Let's see if we can make this happen today, y'all. Yeah. Make it happen, make it happen. About to bait this up, cast it out. Let's see if we can catch that one today, baby. Yeah. That Robo Crab. Yeah. We're going to catch that today. And of course, we have to do our YouTube video for today as well. So let's put in some work. Welcome back to the joy of living. That's what's up. So we back out here. It's Black Friday. It's after Thanksgiving. Let me tell you, man, the pier is still packed. There's like 100 people on the pier. And let me tell you how crabbing is going. It's going pretty good this morning. Let me tell you, man. I seen a bucket with six. I seen a bucket with five. I seen a bucket with three. So they out here pulling up, man. Keep a keep a keep us. So let's see if we can do the same thing today. Make that catch and cook, baby. Let's make it live. Then, I have to set up my charging station to make sure all my equipment is charged throughout the day. What's up? First cast, first reel in. Let's see it's a keeper, baby. We're gonna try to make it happen today. Yeah, boy. We caught it on that rubble crab, man. Caught it on the rubble crab. Yeah, I'm telling you, it holds down. All right, so we're gonna measure this up here. Ooh, shy. Let me show you. Shy like a quarter inch. Look, 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 look at my man. Look at my man already. Alrighty, brother. Go ahead. That's how you do it. Early in the morning, man. All right. I should. I knew I should have came here earlier. There you go. Ah. Yeah, that's small. Second shorty today, man. Oh, it's a female with eggs. <laughs> man, it's pulling up like every 10 minutes, man. That's About what's up. The lines. That's why it got heavy. Man, 
Ain't no way to get out of that, dog. Right Just bring it up. Bring it up. Bring it up. That's it. Oh, that's yours. <laughs> I saw that line. He's loose. One there. keeper. One possible keeper. You got it, huh? One possible keeper. Yep. Yeah, one definitely one keeper, dog. What nails, man? Wait, wait, don't pull on that. Don't pull on that. Go okay. back. I can loosen up that. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. take it. <laughs> no, it looks like okay. a. Ah, uh, this little guy. Hold on. Let's see here. Twice. Yeah. Are you on board? Send it me out. Oh shit. Oh, yeah. No, I don't think so. Alright. Little guys. Under the cliff. Under the cliff. Little peanuts. Little peanuts. Little peanuts. Cut it on that most there, baby. <laughs> Hell yeah. I need some heavier weight ones. <laughs> Damn, look at this. Look at that. I see two in that bucket. I see four or five in that bucket. Man. <laughs> Go ahead. No. Double keeper. Yeah, boy. What? <laughs> what? On that moose there, baby. <laughs> Got him. Get it. Get it. That's what's up. Go ahead, big dog. That's what's up, dog. That's what's up. My dude killing it. Get it. Get it. Get like you trying to make it happen. Yeah. So with you, I always got to make time for my fans, especially the youth. Is that right? How you doing, buddy? Hey, I'm a sucker for kids, man. I got some for you. How you doing? So your mom told me you like to watch the channel, huh? Yeah. That's for you. Yes, I can. Yeah. You're welcome. Nice meeting you, folks. Good luck today. Bye. I'm telling you, that's how it's been looking for me all day. It don't make no damn sense. It don't make no sense at all. I don't even know why I'm still here. I should have took my ass home like 12 hours ago. See that? That's how it's looking for me all day. Like, who did I piss off? So, with everybody picking up seven incher, this is what I pick up. It don't make no sense at all. Not at all. Yeah. And when you can't seem to catch a keeper, what do you do? You cook up some lunch. And for today, I'm going to make that steak taco.
Oh. Oh. oh my god, big! You. Thank you! Congrats, you. Paul! No! Pancet! You go with the pancet! Pancet after pancet, oh, yes, and then no. you go yeah, to a just seafood, just seafood buffet. You give it the no. pancet? Yes. Yeah. Take whatever you want! Make it full, pull it! Pull it. Get, some uh, yeah. Yeah. Get some meat! I got pissed off! More! Where's More! The Where's the cover to this? Right here! <laughs> He's looking for cover. <laughs> over here, we we'll always have spoons. One at a time. It's gonna. You can't mix food. Yes, you do. That's I what know. Thanksgiving yeah, is all about. Pollutant. <laughs> Hors d'oeuvres. Don't worry. Take whatever you want. Take one of each. Crab. Yeah. I'm good on crab, but I'll take another <laughs> shrimp. There you go. Yes. I'm good. Yeah. So awesome. thank you. Thank you. Come grab a taco. Come grab a taco. Let me show you what my kind of day is, all right? Y'all ready to watch this? Let me show you my kind of day. So it's heavy, right? I guarantee it's two small ones. Damn, see? Y'all see my kind of day? That's the type of shit I deal with. Don't make no damn sense at all. I should have left like 12 hours ago. Don't make no sense. Don't make no sense. Don't make no sense. Show you what my kind of day is. GoPro capture. It's like ridiculous. When I mean ridiculous, I mean ridiculous. Look, it's some bull. No damn sense. Wait, are you Tony? How you doing, little man? Hi! Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> you're awesome. You're you watch the channel, huh? Famous. Awesome. What's your name? George. George, you're out here crabbing? Have fun, man. Good luck, okay? Alright, brother. Hey, that's like number eight. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Like but George, videos, I appreciate it. Thank you. You know what? And George, for being a good fan, man, I got something for you, man. This is for George, right? All right, let me take a picture of Tony with George. Wow. Awesome. Right, Come on. Take a picture. Take a photo. Some people boil it. Make it happen. Make it happen. All right, good. There we go. Thank you. Dad, I got one for you too, so you guys can match. Thank you so much. You're welcome. And I wow. wish you guys luck out here, all right? All right thank you. Thank you, Tony. Small foot See you around. All right. Take care, George. Woo! Oh, my God.
There you go, I got him. Yeah, yeah, he's up. Get it, get it! Get it. Keep him going, he's hanging. Don't let Chris touch it, he's gonna lose it! Go <laughs> Alright! Throw it up, throw it up! Throw it up! Alright! That's what's up, yeah! Yeah! Keep her, keep her! Put it on the big gauge! Seven and a quarter, baby! All day! Woo! Damn, go ahead, me, dog. <laughs> yeah. That's what's up. All right, it's spread out. It's a meal. Let's see its legal size, man. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Let's get it. Let's get it. Sam called it. Sam called it. There you go. Woo! Man, I worked hard for this. All right, let me tell you what kind of day it is, man. I've been here since 8 o'clock. All shorties. People pulling left to right. Seven, seven and a quarter. I can't seem to catch it for nothing, man. It's one of them days. What can I say? But look, towards the end of the day, we're going to go ahead and measure it up. Let's see if we can make that happen today, man. So it, it comes out to a little over six inch. Yeah. Close to six and quarter. So let's do that catch and cook, baby. Yeah. All right, man. Let's go ahead and cook this up. Let me tell you, man, I've been here since eight o'clock. Man, catching nothing but short. And while I'm catching all these shorties, everybody around me catching big keepers. So what we gonna do, since I got that one, I'm gonna go ahead and cook it up. And we're gonna keep it simple. Today, I'm just gonna grill the crab directly onto the grill and see how it turns out. So we're gonna do a little surf and turf, baby. Some steak and crabs. Let's make it happen, make it happen. No, 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 no. Oh, just one, just one. I only need one. I, only, I got this one right here. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. I do, I do, I do. I'm not gonna eat it, brother. I do. Grab it, brother. You want me to grill one up for you? That's what I'm about to do. I'm about to grill that one up. <laughs> You're awesome, dude. I appreciate you, brother. Check it out. That's love right there, brother. I no appreciate problem, man. it, man. Anytime, brother. You're the man, dog. I appreciate you, man. <laughs> My parents would love it, man. <laughs> Thank you, brother. All right, let's go ahead and grill up the steak first. Measure that up. Get that rubbed in. And in the seasoning, uh, garlic, salt, cayenne pepper, um, oregano, parsley, and garlic powder, onion powder. Uh, rub that up in there. Make it look real good. Yeah, boy, look at that, look at that. Nice piece of steak. Man. Bone in. Get that rub in there, get it all the way in. The crab, okay, I'm gonna pull it right off the head. And it kills it right away. Pull off the lips, pull the gill so it can stop breathing. You don't want it to suffer. Break it in half, dump it out. And today we're gonna go real rustic with it. So we're gonna keep it just like this. I'm gonna rub some of that spice onto the crab. So that same spice that I rubbed onto the steak, rub it onto the crab. Get it all up in there, marinate it up. Okay, and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna tear it into pieces so it could cook a lot faster oh rather God. than leaving it whole. And I'm gonna keep the carapace around just in case the game warden comes around. You know, we gotta check that. 
Rub it in, rub it in. Look at that. Ooh. Let's make it happen, make it happen. You got to that crab, bro? Mm hmm. When did you clean it? I didn't even notice you cleaning it. Yeah, just right here. Yeah, man. Just like that, baby. Let's grill this up. Yeah. Look at the muscle. See how the muscle tweaking? All right. It's not a lie. Muscle memory. <laughs> Suck this up, baby. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna melt up some butter so that way I can throw it onto the crab and the steak, okay? So we're gonna go ahead and get some tin foil. I'm gonna make a cup out of it. I'm gonna fold it in half. If I don't get one, make a little hole, make a little bowl. We're gonna throw the butter in it. I'm gonna throw some garlic in it. Oh yeah, no. I'm gonna squeeze some lemon. Get that juice up in there. All right, let's throw it, heat it up. Let's pick it up, baby. Surf and turf. off the grill that's how you do right there let's go ahead and make this happen yeah how you doing brother thank you for the shout out man you guys are awesome love how you doing happy thanksgiving happy holiday you guys been, you guys come out crabbing yet oh yeah yeah we've come out a couple times yeah, yeah. how you do all females a lot of shorty pulled up like seven wow so, yeah, yeah. Good. We're good. a lot of shorties too yeah, yeah. yeah. A lot of shorties this morning though, let me tell you, people are picking up like crazy. I see like 30 of them get picked up. Yeah. Seven, seven and a half. Yeah. You know? But, but, but I got here by eight o'clock. Dude next to me got about six. Dude up here got yeah. five. Dude got four. Wow. It was crazy. But after that, nothing. Yeah, yeah. Nothing. Happy Thanksgiving, Joe. Hey, you out? Right, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna, okay. We're going to go put up the tree apparently. Okay. So, brother, I'll see you I next just, time. I what you need to do right now is go to his YouTube channel and hit subscribe. I just got the I just got the page. All right, I'll hit you up. All right. Yeah, man. Well, hopefully I get to care of you guys with you guys out here one day. Yeah, yeah, you know? definitely. Definitely. All right, take care. All right, man. It's been a long day. You see how it was? Let's get down to this and smash on this, man. Real good. Take a look. Take a look. Ooh wee! 
Got that butter. Let's put some of that lemon over there. That's how we're gonna do it right there, baby. Cut into that. And I'm gonna show you. Look at that, perfectly cooked. Perfectly cooked. Oh man. Oh man. That is something else. Something else. <laughs> That's my youngest fan right there. That's what's up. All right. And let me tell you, the butter on the steak make it really moist, you know? Look at that, baby. Woo! Man. Mm, mm, mm. Look at that. Man. Man. Something else. Mm. Tender. Cooked perfectly. About to make that happen. And the grilled crab. Take a look. Mm, mm, mm. Cooked perfectly. Perfectly. Yeah. They know you what to do. Y'all know the man, the legend. That's the man right there, Big Mike. Let me tell you, man, I learned everything from Big Mike, man. That's the man right there. But this off the hook. Oh boy. Left it like fresh crap. How many proposals do you get a We gonna cut that one out. <laughs> Big Mike gonna get me in trouble. <laughs> That's a good job on it, cause what he's doing. Right? Mm-mm. Okay. You think because you grill it, that somehow, that somehow it's dry? It's not. It's moist. That's hella moist. It's hella good. And again, you think you put it on the grill, it's all dried up? It's moist. No, I'm all right, man. Real moist. Mm-mm. -hmm. Mm -hmm. Look at that, baby. Look at that. Ooh wee. Man. Mm -hmm. Fresh crab out the water, into the grill, into your belly. Can't get no better. Can't get no better than that. <laughs> All right, let's crack this open. And you know it's moist when it's jiggly. <laughs> All right. That's how you know it's moist. Man. Mm -mm -mm. Can't get better than that. Can't get better than that. Not at all. That's what's up. Alright, man. You know what kind of day it is? We were trying to beat the sun. Made it just in time. I'm going to go ahead and finish this off. But until next time, peace out. All right, man. Let's go ahead. The day ain't over yet. Let's go ahead and do this. I'm going to show you what I mean. It's about a quarter to seven o'clock. I packed up. Let me show you. I'm about to head out of here.
show ain't over yet. This is what I mean. You want to go crabbing? You got to put in the work to have that good time. Let me show you what I mean. We still got some more work to do. All right, 30 minutes later, we made it to the house, but we still not done. We still more work to do. Check it out. because I still have to clean up the crab. I still have to clean everything here, sanitize, wash everything down, repack it for next time. And that's the basket, everything. I have to wipe everything down and I have to wipe the poles down as well, clean it up. It's a lot of work. So people ask, is it worth it? At the end of the day, you know, we don't go out there to catch. That's not the point. Because if you go out there just to catch, you might be disappointed by putting all that work in and get nothing at the end of the day. Me, let me tell you, I got lucky. I caught one before the end of the day. Sometimes like that. Sometimes you go out there three, four hours, you catch 10. Sometimes you're out there for 12 hours and you catch one. So it's not about catching. It's about meeting new people, hanging out, being outdoor, enjoying the craft, and sharing with the community. You know, that's what it's really about. So if you're out there just to catch, you're going to be very disappointed. But if you're out there for the experience, all this work is definitely worth it. So I appreciate everybody for watching. Until next time, peace out. <laughs>